How do you do, ladies and gentlemen? This is Cleet Roberts speaking. My work as a world reporter takes me to many countries. I meet many people. Very often, I meet people who are not too happy about their present way of life or what they see in the future. I meet some downright pessimistic individuals, as a matter of fact. But every once in a while, I run into people who have an honest enthusiasm for living. They're cheerful about the, the whole aspect they see ahead of them. They like their surroundings. They like everything that Mother Nature offers them in the country that they may live. They like their neighbors. I was up in Canada the other day. This would be the Canadian border. This would be Montana. This would be Washington. I was up in a little town called Grand Prairie up in Alberta. I wandered around the town. I met some wonderful people. They were friendly. I was a total stranger, and yet they unburdened themselves. They told me about their lives more than anything else. They communicated to me their, well, their optimism about life. I want you to come with me now to Grand Prairie and share in these experiences in the next World Report. This is Grand Prairie, Alberta, Canada. This is the mud of Grand Prairie, the mud that virtually overlays the town after every frequent rain. I'm standing in the main street of Grand Prairie, a city of about 4,000 souls, located in the great Peace River region of western Canada, an area about 200 by 400 miles in size, just about the size of the state of Michigan. 80,000 people live in the Peace River District up here in the north. Farming is the main occupation. Some of the greatest seed grains in the world are produced near here. Now this town, Grand Prairie, is the main business and distribution center for the hard-working farmers who dwell here. Last night, I wandered around Grand Prairie and talked with some of the citizens of this town. I invite you now to sit in on those conversations. <laughs> 